Hello everybody out there in YouTube land. This is Tyler. I am coming with another video request which was asked for me to do and this was from a person named Ann Fink. I know you probably thought that I forgot about your video request but I have not forgot about your video request simply because I am a working man and that I want to sit here and I want to say this to you. Thanking I thank you for taking the time to ask me to do a video request which we're going to call this how to spot a narcissist but I know that you came to me talking about that this was pertaining to a narcissist individual but like I'm going to repeat again the title of this video is going to be how to spot a narcissist part three and that I'm not just only doing it for this person's sake but for every single person that is out there watching this video and that let me just go on ahead and say this right quick you got to understand something a narcissist person is a selfish is a self-centered person they are only looking after for themselves and looking after for self they're not out there looking out for the out for other out for a particular person rather it might be their family members or matter might be anyone else that is close to them that particular person is actually looking after for self and self only and self only alone and that I'm just gonna go on ahead and go into this how to spark a narcissist and this is one main point I'm going to put and that whenever you find a person trying to stop you from your spiritual journey or the destiny that you are wanting to go on which is a good thing in order to better your life or to enhance your life just like your spiritual journey as well whenever you find a particular person that is trying to stop you from those particular things it when you find a person that is wanting to do that towards you, in other words, wanting to control your life and do not want you to go on that particular spiritual journey and want to stop you from that, and every time you turn around, that particular person is trying to down you or that particular person is don't even want you to go based on their judgment of how they see it, and you know for a fact that this would be the better for you and it will be much better for you for the good when you find a person trying to hinder you from that this is what you call a narcissist person and the reason why that that narcissist person is doing that is simply because that person do not want you to advance and whenever it comes to Whenever it comes to your destination, if you are trying to complete a goal or wants you to enhance your spiritual journey, want to cause changes up into your life. And the reason why that that narcissist person is like that is because they have a mentality of a crab in the bucket mentality trying to pull you down at the same level as they are. In other words, they want to have total control over you. So, I know a lot of you people will sit there and say, whenever it comes to a decision that is for the good for you or for the best of you, rather it's your spiritual journey or rather it's a destination that you're trying to complete your, your goal or complete your objective and it's good for you so that you can enhance your life and that you'll probably sit there and say whenever you come to that narcissist individual right and a lot of times it's your family members or it's so-called friends when you come to that particular decision that you want to do this go on this go and continue this and then this narcissist person sitting there attacking it and you know the reason why that that narcissist person attacks it because that person do not want to see the best up out of you because they themselves have a mentality to that they want to control you you don't need to step out of the comfort zone you don't need to step out of the boundary so in other words they want to judge you for it and that like i'm saying earlier like a lot of you people say that you don't want to disappoint them sometimes you have to disappoint those type of people in order to get to where you go because you know it's the better advancement for your good and for you only you have to disappoint those type of narcissist people and make them mad and upset because only thing that will reveal that it reveals that narcissist person's true colors of who they actually are and actually are they are haters that don't want to see you go to the next level just putting it just as plain as terms just like that and that I sit here and I tell you that those people are going to be mad at you going to be mad at you and that I sit here and I say 
Whenever it comes to you making that good decision for the best of you and your journey and that person trying to hinder you and that person, get, that narcissist person getting mad at you, you like, I'm gone. I ain't got time for your ass. That's how you need to be and that's how you, your mentality need to be. Because, like I'm saying earlier, some people got this damn crab in a bucket mentality. They just want to pull you along or whatever just for their control and their selfish interest because just because they don't like it because you're trying to enhance your spiritual journey or you're trying to no nah, I'm not going to say you're trying to enhance your spiritual journey you are wanting to enhance your spiritual journey and you're focused on enhancing your spiritual journey or you are focused on enhancing in that goal and completing that goal of mission and they get mad and upset and I'm going to sit there and I will say again, let them folks get mad and you like, and you will find a new person that will appreciate you or have the same type of mindset as you while they're getting mad and while they're being jealous. And that, let me just go on ahead and cut this video short and that I repeat again that let no one hinder you. No one hinder you if you're trying to better yourself for the good. Rather it's your spiritual journey or rather it's your destiny that you are wanting to create. Because I'm going to tell you something. You allow your, yourself to be around that shit for so long. It is going to cause an inward corruption up inside of you. Being like that narcissist individual. Having that same mentality. It's just like they sit there and say whatever you hang around the most or whatever company or company you hang around the most rather is good or bad that's what you will become and but like I said let me go on ahead and cut this video short if you liked and enjoyed this video I give you the invitation to please subscribe to this channel and you'll receive weekly content on a weekly basis thank you and have a great and awesome evening I'm just to get ready for work people